just a little warning. This could turn into a rant. And I know it's pretty rare for anyone to see me actually angry, angry, but I'm losing my fucking mind. And there isn't a jar big enough. There isn't enough money for me to put into this fucking thing that um, will ever, like, I can't even speak, do justice to how upset I am right now. On behalf of every victim survivor of narcissistic abuse throughout their childhood. Somebody sent me a video yesterday of one of these self-awares, you know, the MPD people that are now part of the healing community. Thanks, TikTok. You know, you'll take down our accounts for speaking out against abuse, but you won't take down or limit the accounts of actual perpetrators who admit that they're perpetrators, who are minimizing the um, abuse that they, I'm going to say it again, perpetrate against children, their own children, the emotional violence. This fucking person posted a video where he is reenacting what it looks like. And it's almost funny and playful. He's rejecting his child's dream of playing a particular sport, saying you're not good enough and you should stay in your lane and you'll be an embarrassment to me. And if that's all it was, which is pretty bad, we would be like not no contact with our parents. Like if that's all it looked like, but that's not what it fucking looks like or feels like. The emotional violence that a narcissist parent perpetrates against their child starts at birth, telling us who we are, who we aren't, that we have no value, and the abuse is nonstop because even when it's in a resting place where they're not actively rejecting and treating us like we're nothing, we're waiting for the next shoe to drop. That's what it looks like. It doesn't look like this little one minute video. And for all the people out there who always comment when I'm talking about this and say, but I follow them, I find value. You're finding value in an abuser who is fucking gaslighting you. Attach yourself to the healing community and stand with the victims and the survivors, especially the ones they've left behind, instead of giving steam to a message that is devaluing and minimizing what they actually do to other human beings, especially their own children.